We are in the NMR lab at the North Carolina Research Campus, and here we have a few different NMR instruments. NMR stands for Nuclear Magnetic Resonance, which is actually similar to MRIs. MRI is actually just magnetic resonance imaging. So we have here a few instruments that are very similar to MRIs. This one and uh, the one behind me, which is actually one of the largest in the world for its kind. And essentially, instead of putting a human into an MRI, we put a small sample very similar to this, which is just half a milliliter of sample. So this facility is housed in the David H. Murdoch Research Institute, and a lot of people that come use the facility are either from the North Carolina Research Campus, we have a few researchers on the campus that use it, and also from other universities, many universities in the state of North Carolina, a few others in the southeast region, such as Maryland, Frederick, Maryland, uh, Tennessee, Virginia, and possibly even Illinois in the future. Uh, so that it's these kind of people that are coming to use the facility for its uh, exotic usage and the fact that we have one of the larger instruments in the world. So the results that you obtain from, from these types of instruments are very valuable to uh, determining different compounds, different metabolites in your body, and uh, this goes along with the overall mission of trying to improve human health. If we can analyze metabolites in the body, then we can understand uh, what different health effects are, are leading to different conditions in your body, what different foods you eat lead to different positive or negative effects in your body. We can do this by analyzing compounds uh, on a metabolite level, and these instruments can be used for that. And also, an, another overall arching goal is to improve human health in general, so we can actually look at the protein molecules uh, using the structure determination pro of proteins using these instruments, and use that to actually uh, determine what kind of new drug molecules we might be able to use, or, or what kind of foods are good for, for substituting for drug molecules or supplements that we can use in our body to, to perform certain functions and improve our health in general. People are coming here, universities, government agencies, and industry are all coming here because of the instrumentation here that's available is not available in many other situations. It's very unique and exotic, such as the 950 here. It's, it's the only one in the country of its kind, and there's not very, even very many instruments that are close to its kind in, in, the, in the country. So it definitely brings people in that do not have the financial backing to afford this kind of instruments or or the know-how to use them. Uh, it, it allows them to come here and, and work with us. And the, this is not only true with the NMR, but other laboratories in, in the David H. Murdoch Research Institute, but definitely this is the case here.